It was March 2020. The streets were empty. The shops closed. People couldn't get out. But spring did not know. The flowers began to bloom. The sun shone, the birds sang, the swallows would soon arrive. The sky was blue and the morning arrived early. It was March 2020. Young people had to study online and find occupations at home. People, people could no longer go shopping or go to the hairdressers. Soon there would be no more room in hospitals and people continued to get sick. And spring did not know. The time to go to the garden arrived and the grass greened. It was March 2020. People have been put in lockdown to protect grandparents, families and children. No more meetings or meals, family celebrations. The fear became real and the days were therefore similar. But spring did not know. Apples, cherry trees and others bloomed. The leaves grew. People started reading, playing with their families, learning a language, singing on the balcony and inviting their neighbours to do the same. Being supportive and focusing on other values. People realise the importance of health, of suffering, of this world that had stopped, of the economy that had plummeted. But spring did not know. Flowers gave way to the fruit, the birds made their nest, the swallows had arrived. Soon the day of liberation came. People found out on TV. The virus had lost. The virus had lost. People took to the streets, sang, kissed their neighbours, without masks or gloves. And that's when summer came, because spring didn't know. He continued to be there despite everything, despite the virus, fear and death. Everything. Despite the virus, fear and death. Because spring did not know, he taught people to believe the power of life. Everything's going to be fine. Stay home, protect yourself, and enjoy life. Everything's gonna be fine. Stay home, protect yourself, and enjoy life.